As of November 2019, there were over 300 travel nurse agencies catering to the travel nurse communities. So how do I, a current travel nurse, narrow down this list to find the right travel nurse company for me? Here's what I look for. Welcome everyone to the Mama Nurse channel. I'm Vanessa and here we discuss all things nursing, motherhood, and lifestyle. Make sure you leave a like on this video. Comment down below, are you a current travel nurse? And don't forget to subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss out on any uploads. Anytime I decide to change or pick a new travel nurse company, I go ahead and start with my first step, which is Googling the top 10 travel nurse companies from the previous year. This is typically based off of ratings and opinions of previous or current travel nurses. This helps me narrow down the list to the top rated travel nurse companies for the previous year to help me decide which one's right for me. From here, I find the companies that offer a few very important things for myself and my family. Here are my top seven. Number one, health insurance. I know this one isn't everybody's top pick because some travel nurses choose to get private insurance. That's not the route that I take, but as a travel nurse who travels with her family, health insurance is very important. So I always have to make sure that the travel nurse company that I choose offers health insurance. Number two, incentives. I typically look for a travel nurse company that's going to offer travel expenses, referral bonuses, and loyalty bonuses, just to name a few. You have some travel companies that do not offer any incentives. That is not the company for me. Number three, accessible and responsive recruiters. Typically, when I do narrow down my list to my top three, I reach out to a recruiter. Based on who I talk to and how the conversation goes, gives me the feel of if this recruiter and company is gonna be responsive and accessible. I need somebody who's gonna to respond to my text messages in regards to certain positions and be able to submit me for a job ASAP if needed. Number four, a company that offers jobs in the locations that I prefer. Back in 2017, when I had my very first travel nurse assignment, I only wanted to travel in Florida. So for me at that point, having a company that offered jobs in Florida specifically was very important. Now I'm a little bit more flexible. I do have my compact license, so I'm not as restricted to staying in Florida or any specific area. However, be aware that some companies specialize in certain areas and have already built that rapport with hospitals in certain areas. So it is nice to know which company your preferred hospital works with the most. Number five, a company that offers 401k investment opportunities. Even though I'm not a staff nurse, I still want to be able to plan for my future and my retirement. So being able to invest in a 401k or 403b plan is very important to me. So I try to choose a company that does offer this. Number six, Companies that offer local contracts versus travel contracts and both. You have some travel nurse agencies that do not offer local contracts. Sometimes it's nice to go back home, be able to relax with your family for a little bit. So I do typically prefer companies that offer both local and travel assignments. And number seven, no penalties. I don't want to be penalized or have to pay back a company if I say call out for a shift, have to end my contract early for a family emergency or whatever the case may be. So I do typically look for companies that do not penalize their travel nurses for unexpected events. All of these things that I've talked about today should be discussed with your recruiter or your travel nurse company ahead of time before you even start looking for assignments. That way you know exactly what you're getting into and what you can expect for the future of your travel nurse assignment. Picking the right company and recruiter can make or break your travel nurse experience. It can either make you want to travel endlessly or go back to staff nursing indefinitely. So choose wisely. 
If you are looking for a new recruiter or travel nurse agency, please feel free to comment down below and I can send over my recruiter's information. I do typically work with at least two or three recruiters and travel nurse agencies, depending on who has the best contracts, who's actively looking for me. Every time I'm looking for a new assignment, there's a couple people on board with me and we're all looking for the same thing, a good travel nurse assignment. However, even though I'm working with multiple recruiters, I one, let them know ahead of time that I am working with other recruiters. That way they're not blindsided if I choose an assignment with another company. And two, you wanna make sure that you do not submit for the same hospital with multiple companies. Whoever you choose to go with, make sure that is the only company that is gonna submit you for that assignment. So what questions do you have about picking a travel nurse company? Comment down below. As always, I hope this information was beneficial to you. Make sure you leave a like on this video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And until next time, all love.